What's up everybody, this is Derek here and in this video I'm going to be showcasing how to link a second social media platform to your PUBG mobile account. This is something that was introduced with the 0.6.0 update, the most recent global update, and it was actually 0.5.0, the previous update, the one that introduced Miramar, that also gave us additional login options. So before that update, we only had Guest and Facebook as potential login options, and 0.5.0 brought us Google Play, Twitter, and WeChat, so three new social media platforms to use. So now we'll jump into our Google Play account and I'll show you how to link a second social media account to the same PUBG mobile account. So here we are on the main menu screen and we're gonna go up to settings in the top right and then we'll take a look at linked. Right now it says Google Play and why would you want to do this? Well, one of the most common reasons I can imagine is that I'm playing with a Google Play account right now. However, what if I end up getting an iPhone a few months from now and I don't want to lose my progress on my PUBG mobile account? Well, obviously an iPhone can't access the Google Play Store. However, something common like Twitter or Facebook or WeChat could be used with either software platform. So that's a potential option, that's a potential reason for linking two accounts to the same PUBG mobile account. Another potential reason would be if you are linked to Facebook and you just want to delete your Facebook account and have nothing to do with it and you didn't use a fake one so you can't, you know, you didn't use a fake one just for the game. So in that situation, if you don't want to lose the progress you've made in the game, you're going to need to link another account to it. Another reason might be if one of your accounts gets hacked and the hackers delete all your information. Then if you have another account linked to it, you can still access your game data using that one. So there are a number of reasons, I think, why you would want to do this. And unfortunately though, this doesn't, so 0 0.6.0 introduces the ability to link more than one account, but it doesn't introduce account management. So first I'll show you how to link another account and then we'll talk about account management and why I think this is what we really, really need in the next update. So you can see here that we now have the option. So what I did there is I clicked on more underneath Google Play. So whatever your linked account is currently, it could be Facebook or Twitter or Google Play. Then when you click on more, you're given the other options. So the other three options, or it depends on your device, but the other options that are available for your device to also link to. So Facebook is my Leech Shield character, so I can't use that. But how about Twitter? So let's go ahead here. And now it says, keep your account linked to Google Play. So this is what I was talking about earlier, account management. Eventually, you'll be able to actually delete character data or transfer it from one platform to another. But right now, that's not possible. So you can imagine that there should be another option here. It should be keep your account linked to Google Play, question mark, and then there should be no, which would unlink it from Google Play and link it to a new platform. OK, which is how you add a second account. So that's what we're doing. And then cancel just takes you back to the previous screen, doesn't do anything. So if we click OK, now what we'll have to do is we'll log into Twitter, authorize PUBG Mobile to use your account. So we'll go ahead and log into Twitter and then I'll be back. All right, so there we go. We have now logged into Twitter. I'm going to say authorize app. And now you can see it says now you can log in with Twitter. So it's not account management yet. That's something I still want to see, but at least now you can link two social media platforms to the same PUBG mobile account. And you can see that here because we now have a Twitter logo there as well as a Google Play logo. And now if I wanted to log in with an iOS device, I could link or I could just log in to Twitter on that iOS device and access this rough character account just like I can access it via Google Play or Twitter on this Android device. So eventually, I'm really hoping that they introduce account management. The other issue is a few people transferred accounts to social media platforms accidentally, or they transferred their guest account, which is level one to a social media platform, and now they have a level one Google Play account that they can't do anything with, they don't wanna level it up, but they also can't link something else to that because something's already linked to it. It just gets confusing, but Basically, this is a good first step. 
you can see I, I'm clicking on Twitter or Google Play, neither one does anything. So it looks like once you do this, until they introduce management, that's it. So I'm tapping on the screen and nothing is happening. So, but we did it. We linked a second social media platform to the same PUBG mobile account, one that was already linked to a different platform. So if this video helped you out, definitely give it a thumbs up. Uh, definitely share it with your friends. That really helps the channel. And consider subscribing if you haven't already for tons more PUBG mobile content. If you want to see any other explanations on something that's either new or changed with the 0.6.0 update, definitely leave those video suggestions in the comments down below because I do read them and I use them as the basis for future videos because if you want to see something, chances are other people do too. My name's Derek G, and I hope to see you on the battlefield soon.